Okay, okay, stop. One minute. I know what you're all thinking. I've seen this all before. And you're right, yes, you have. That is because this video is entirely made up of a kind of speech rant type thing that I went on that was meant to go at the end of the last video. However, I decided um, that what I was saying and what I was talking about and just the length of the video in itself um, was worthy kind of of its own video, of its own kind of topic, if you like. And so I wanted to separate this out. Um, also know that there will be an extra video this week. It will either be live on Thursday or Friday. Let me know in the comment section down below. I'll put a kind of poll. The day that gets the most likes, I will upload it on that day. So just wanted to kind of have a little bit more of a raw type video today. Um, kind of ranting my thoughts from last weekend, it was last Friday. Um, and yeah, it's it's a good video in, in my opinion anyway, just to let things out sometimes, you know, it's good. So, don't worry, you're not going crazy. That first clip, you, you had already seen it, but anyway. Drop a like if you're excited, guys. Oh, I forgot to say, what's up guys, Liam here. Anyway, drop a like if you're excited, and let's get into the the actual video. Okay. Um, I actually finished that hours ago, I just did that for the video. Anyway, <laughs> I wanted to have a quick chat with you guys. Um, something's been kind of playing on my mind, because like, do you ever find yourself on your own at home and you just have a lot of thinking time? Um, I've had that tonight, right? And it was something that kind of played on my mind all day, um, bearing in mind some people from work um, are attending what I'm about to talk about. Um, you guys know the extent as to how much I love what I'm about to talk about as well. Um, and essentially what I'm about to say is that I'm missing out on that, you know. That if I was still at university, I would be doing this right now. Like, this is what I feel like I should be doing right now. Um, when the reality is I'm sat at home on my own. No Charlotte, no mum and dad, and I just ate a whole freaking large pizza to myself. Um, and that thing is Eldot, last day of term, um, Cliffmas, as it gets called. Uh, if you've been following the channel for a while, you'll know my love for the last day of term, my love for Eldot. Always first at the bar and always one of the last to leave. Um, if you saw my graduation video, you know, I, I, I cried on the last one. You know, it's just how it is. Uh, that is happening right now. Um, literally right now, I mean, it's half past ten at night um, at the time of filming this. And so that is when people start to get to the nighttime portion of Eldot. So I was always there around nine, ten o'clock in the morning. You would start with a full English breakfast. You would start with a snake bite, right? And myself and my mates, whoever that, uh, that may be that was able to kind of tag along at the time, um, would do. That was what we would do. We would get there as early as possible and we would almost pride ourselves on being like the first of the bar and all this kind of stuff. Um, well, more me, me, more so me than anyone else, but anyway. Um, that is happening right now. Eldar is happening now. Um, and when I say now, I literally mean right this second. People, freshers, third years, everyone alike is enjoying their last day of term um, before Christmas. Number one, that means they get a Christmas break, and they get to come home, they get to go see their families. Yes, I live with mine again now. However, that break from education, and that break from whatever you're doing, and those responsibilities, um, I don't have anymore. And that's one more thing that um, is kind of playing on my mind. You know, I'm just gonna be busy over the festive period, especially with making videos and all that kind of stuff. Um, I'm just gonna have a lot more on my plate than, than I normally would, you know? Um, but the thing that's been playing on my mind the most is the fact that I am missing LDOT for the first time in three years, right? I was a first year in 2015, 16, 17, 18, 18, like, you know, I finished a few months ago now, obviously this is graduation episode 41, 
the first episode being sort of my actual graduation day. Um, and to be honest, it has got in my head a little bit. I was beginning to think, and you guys could probably see uh, in videos, that I was kind of not over not being at university, but just like, like I said a few videos ago, you're just used to not being there, if that makes sense. Um, and that kind of mentality of, oh, I'm missing out on this, I'm missing out on that, had just kind of slowly started to fade away. Um, that was until today, bearing in mind I've been at work this morning. Um, a fair few people at work, bearing in mind I work in Nottingham, do still go to Trent. And so are going to LDOT, either have a ticket or are optionally not going to LDOT, which I was deeply offended by. I mean, not, not obviously not really offended, but I was just like, what? So essentially what I've been thinking tonight is just, um, well, how much things have changed really, to, to be completely honest with you. I mean, not even this time like last year, you know, this time a couple months ago, I, I had my last L dot. Um, well, not a couple months ago, it's more like, more like five or six months ago now, wow. But, uh, um, <laughs> right, focus Liam, focus. Um, I don't, I don't know, I don't really know how I feel about it. I'm, I don't feel okay about it, I'm not gonna lie. This is the first one that I have missed. You know, I kind of, it, I, I just love the whole atmosphere. You would be in a room with a bunch of your friends, just having a good time all day. You'd go home, relax, eat some food, and then you'd come back and have a great night as well. That is what was so great. That's what I love so much about Elder. Um, and the qu kind of quick transformation, I know a few months is a, is a long time and stuff, but in the grand scheme of things, that's nothing. And so, the quick transformation, the quick flip switch is what I always say. Um, between doing that and having the freedom and the ability to do that, and the situation that I'm in now, kind of coming home today after a nine day stint at work. I didn't have a job throughout university. I was, I was fortunate enough to not need to get a job. Um, and so kind of working life when it hit me, boom, it hit me like a brick wall, you know? Um, and it's taken me a while to get used to it. And bearing in mind all the different changes with, with uh, like, was just stuff like this, you know, Eldar, um, uh, not having any work, but then also, like, any, any studies to kind of do, but then having different responsibilities in terms of, like, well, working life and stuff. It's just, it's life, you know, it's, it, it, it is how it goes. It's how the cookie crumbles, if you like. Um... But that doesn't mean it doesn't come as a shock to the system, you know? I was aware that this was eventually going to happen, um, and I was aware um, that I was probably not gonna feel the best about it. Um, I mean, I, I, I'm trying to think of a way to explain it, and, and to be honest, I, no, I can't. Um, I want to say it's okay because it's what happens. You know, you, you you grow up. This is a part of growing up. This is a part of me progressing to the next kind of stage in my life, if you like. Um, university uh, had to finish in order for that to happen. You know, myself and Charlotte want to go off and, and see the world a little bit. We want to, you know, start our own lives, have our own house, build our own lives in the future, you know, and as much as we both, in fact, as much as we both loved university, we couldn't do that whilst we were at university. And so having things like LDOT and the luxury of freedom, because freedom is a luxury, it's a massive luxury. And it's one that you do just have as a student because you have that time, especially if you are lucky and fortunate enough like myself to have not had to have a job throughout university. Um, and so that freedom is kind of, well, it's gone. It's, it's not gone completely. I'm like, I mean, I have the Christmas party on the day that this, this video goes out, you know, the work Christmas party. It's going to be a great laugh. I've never been to one of them before. And so hopefully, hopefully it's going to be a good, a good night, you know. Um, but it was just kind of being on my own right now when everybody else is kind of out there enjoying their L dot, um, just got me kind of, thinking, you know, um, and like I say, 
the fact that we are no longer there and we are missing out on stuff like that, yeah, we are missing out, but, you know, we can live our life in a different way now because that's what, that's the situation that we are in now. And the situation that we are in now allows me to earn some money which I didn't have before. It allows me to do things with Charlotte that I couldn't really afford to do before. And, you know, it allows me to save a little bit of a, a little, a little bit of money. It allows me to save a little bit of money, kind of bit by bit, so that eventually myself and Charlotte can go off and start our own lives in the way that we want to do. And that just wouldn't have been a possibility, not, not really, just with being at university. Um, and so, it's okay. I mean, I know I just kind of listed a thousand reasons as to why it's not, but it is, because at the end of the day, when it all comes down to it, the one thing I want the most is to progress in my life with Charlotte. We want to go off, we want to do our own whatever, and that requires to not be at university. It's as simple as that, it requires work, it requires money, and that kind of stuff, for us anyway, just wouldn't work at university. And so we have to put that behind us, we have to put LDOT behind us, we have to put the work behind us and the lectures and everything that went along with it, right? The good, the bad and the ugly, you know? Um, in order to move on, in order to move forwards. And that is exactly what we're doing right now. So me, sat on my own on a Friday night after a nine day stint, nine days in a row at work. That's why it's a good thing. Because it's getting me one step closer to where I want to be. I hope you guys have enjoyed today's video. Um, I hope you may be taking something from it if you feel like you're missing out on something especially around the festive period, try and find a positive in it because, you know, you'd be surprised the difference it, it makes to you moving forward. So I want to thank you guys. As always, thank you so much for tuning in today. Drop a like, comment down below, subscribe if you are new, click that notification bell wherever it may be. I never know. I never know. <laughs> anyway, right, I am off. What am I going to do? I might have a pink gin. I think I might have a pink gin. Yeah. Cheers to that, everybody. Thank you so much for watching. Together, we will grow. Thank you for supporting me. Thank you for staying with me on this fucking weird journey that we're having right now. So, together we will grow. I will see you in the next one.